This is a free tutorial about how to use the Callouts Pack for Adobe Premiere Pro. First, import the Mogurt file in the Premiere Pro. Every Mogurt has two versions, 18 and 19. There are two ways. You could import them one by one, clicking on the cross symbol on the bottom side of the Premiere Pro. or copy all the Mogurt files in the Motion Graphics Templates folder. You could find this folder in your machine on this destination. Mind that you could preview all the Mogurt setups in the preview folder, which is included on the zip file. Import the Mogurt file on your sequence. The default resolution of Mogurt files is 4K, so if you are working on a smaller resolution, mind scaling all the elements like this. Type anything on the text holders. The box's size will fit onto the text size. If you're working on version 19, you could change the fonts. Also, you could adjust the duration easy with the new special feature of Adobe Premiere Pro, like this. If you are using version 18, you could add a frame hold. Adjust position, size, color, width for everything. With these two sliders, you could change the graphics elements, like this. You could find a preview guide to choose the right one. That's all. Thanks for watching. This is a free tutorial about how to use the Callouts pack for Adobe After Effects. First, preview the callouts from the HTML file. Drag and drop the callout composition into your composition, or copy all the elements and paste them. Type anything on the text holders. The box's size will fit on the text size. Use these null layers to adjust the position of the callout.
change position, size, color, width, etc. from the control panel. To change the graphic elements, open the Animated Elements folder. Open a category. Select the element that you like to switch on your timeline. Hold the Alt key. Drag and drop the new element on the old one like this. That's all. Thanks for watching.